Today we're playing an insane try not to cry challenge, but Bambolina from Garden of Bam Bam is playing with us. This is impossible because Bambolina never cries. That's right. Nothing can make me sad. Bambolina, you're amazing. You'll be surprised, Adam, because at the end of this video, we reveal a Garden of Bam Bam animation that was so sad, it actually made Bambolina start crying. What? That's impossible. Let's go! Okay, don't cry. Ooh, I Tell me what's wrong and why you never said you felt that way And guess you're trying to stay strong and fake a smile until I <laughs> I'm gonna cry out of confusion <laughs> No guys, we both have we both have five lives as you can see We got some crazy sad videos for you guys to see today Okay, so she gave him a ring candy and then she had another one We're about to see, I know this one's sad Alright, alright What? Now they're getting married! Wait, what is going on? She gave him candy and now they're gonna be mommy and daddy? You better not cry, dude, uh, or you're gonna uh, lose uh, a heart! Uh, 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 <laughs> uh, So it's like they're living their whole life, but they're still kids. Yeah, I love using these machines outside the supermarket. Yeah. I always go on them, dude. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you see that? He had a little smile. He's starting to fall in love. Wow. Wait. If they're falling in love, and this is a try not to cry, do you think one of them's going to... Guys, don't cry yet. Don't cry yet. We still both have five lives, guys. We have not cried, but I got a bad feeling about this what video. What is good? Let's see. <laughs> don't cry. Hey, yo. <laughs> What's going on, bro? She's got a balloon in the tummy. What? Wow. She went from this to this, bro. <laughs> What's going on? Like, what's going on, bro? We're gonna see, guys. What? Oh, it's a balloon. Yeah. <laughs> oh, what? Well, hey, yo. Wow, they had a baby? <laughs> That's crazy! <laughs> I told you they became mommy and daddy. <laughs> became mommy and daddy. All right, let's see. What's going on, man? Don't cry, I'm guys. Not. No. What? What? Hey, yo. <laughs> what? Bro. Oh no! Wait a minute. Now this is getting really sad. He. He didn't want to, like, be friends with the plushie baby. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. It doesn't count if we laugh. We're still at full health. Why do you laugh at that? You got no heart. Let's see how this video no ends. no heart. Let's see how this video you got ends. no heart. You got a lot of heart. <laughs> <laughs> Keep going. What is going on, man? understand what's going on man okay guys i lost a heart but that's okay wow bro oh 
Oh, what is this? It's a super sad Five Nights at Freddy's animation. Whoa, my tongue gummer gator. Huh? He's losing control. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Okay, they got in a car crash. Beep, 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 beep. And it'll come blowing. Let's see what happens. Okay, Monty Gator, he's all right, guys. Oh, he lost the arm. Wait, what? Oh! What? He's covered in ooh. <laughs> Change his diaper. Oh, this is sad. It's baby Freddy, and now he's all alone because it's his dad. Oof. His dad. Grandma Freddy. Oof. I think so. Oh, that's so sad. Don't cry. Don't cry. Don't cry. Don't cry. Okay, keep going. Keep going. Keep going. <laughs> what was that? Okay, nah, now nah, nah, Monty Gator is nah. the worst daddy ever. Yo, <laughs> Monty <Fact>. Daddy. <laughs> what is going on? He just oofed Freddy twice. Okay, let's see where this video goes. So he got his own son at home. Daddy. Baby Gator. He's your brother. Five years later. So they're brothers now. Oh, they're brothers. Right, like us. Brothers. <laughs> <laughs> Is their teacher Vanny? <laughs> That's so sad, bro. He got a gift for his son, the baby gamer, but nothing for Glamrock Freddy's baby. Wow. Now, you haven't cried yet. You're doing good. I got close. You, you think this video's gonna make you cry? I, we'll see. All right, all right. We'll let's see. see. I, I'll cry. <laughs> <laughs> He wants the guitar, they're gonna break it. What? That's the oof of his day! Wow! So on the news, guys, this is Glamrock Freddy who got oof. Let's see. Oh, that's so sad. Bro, his daddy oofed his other daddy. Wow. Daddy versus daddy. <laughs> For the baby. <laughs> <laughs> That's actually so sad, guys, because baby Gregory. Wait, you just lost a heart. <laughs> so did you. Yeah, but baby Freddy is going to have to choose. Will he love his new daddy, Monty Gator, or will he say no? Monty Gator's actually a bad person, and I don't want to be in this family. He's gonna say, oh, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Let's see what he does. Wow. Oh 
my goodness. We get to choose our own ending, guys. He's gonna oof his brother, or he's gonna save his brother. Oh boy, what do you think he's gonna choose? I don't know, I think we're gonna see both versions. Let's see it. Why would he oof his brother though? His brother had nothing to do with this. Oh my goodness. Just in version one, he oofed his new baby and his new brother. Wow, using the button from Five Nights at Freddy's. That's not all right. <laughs> what? <laughs> Freddy turned evil. Some evil spirits grabbed him. Wow, so that was version one. Let's see version two. This way he's gonna save his brother. He's gonna be good. Do the right thing, do, guys. Do the right thing, Freddy. <laughs> he's thinking, what would my daddy do? <laughs> do what the daddy do. <laughs> it's not fine. It's not fine. <laughs> He saved it. What is what is Monty Gator doing? What? <laughs> and then his baby came out of the spirit realm and saved him, bro. I oh, dude. That was so sad, I actually passed out passed for a second. Out. This would be a good time, everybody. If you got the leggy box blanket <laughs> or the plushies, get cozy, because I'm passed out, bro. Guys, we, we, we got a lot of crazy sad videos to show you. Here we go. <laughs> <coughs> he was saved by Angel Daddy Freddy. That's what I just said. <laughs> I was passed out, I didn't hear you. <laughs> They're evil. And they got taken by the evil spirits now. Wow. 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 Daddy! He said daddy? <laughs> Next video! Okay, was this like a granny? Yep. It's a granny. That must be her son? Her grandson, probably, or she her son. She loves him very much. You can see how much photo she has of him. That's her grandson? Yeah, it's her family. Bro, he an e-boy, man. Wow. He's probably on TikTok, bro. Yeah, you're right. He's probably on TikTok, man. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not allowed on TikTok. <laughs> she wants a hug. <gasps> Oh, wow. That's messed up, bro. And he skated past her. Dude, oh, why would you not hug your granny, bro? That's so rude, bro. Wow, dude. He was a skater boy, and then he said, see you later, granny. See you later, bro. See you Oh, wow. Rude. And mom always plays that song in the car. She loves that song. This is gonna be so sad, guys. Don't cry, whatever you do. Um, this is making me sad, bro. <gasps> She's gonna try and cheer him up with cookies. <gasps> Granny's cookies! <laughs> Are you crying? Oh, no, guys, Justin has lost a heart. <laughs> it's cause I want cookies! <laughs> cookie time, cookie time, cookie time, cookie time, I want crackheads! <laughs> Dude, I knew he's on TikTok.
grandma is so sad. How are you gonna treat your own granny like this, bro? Let's see. Oh, so this is why you always want to be nice to your grandma. Yeah. Huh? Oh my goodness. Oh, this is scary. Hey, yo, hey, yo they kind of. <laughs> 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 you know what I mean? So funny, eh? Yeah, you love so, that so dance. So funny, eh? Your shake Fonzie dance. Fonzie does that dance too. <laughs> <laughs> Lucky Box can do it. <laughs> All the punches can do it. What is going on, bro? They're multiplying. Oh no. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh wow. They tied him up. He should have just given his grandma a hug and hung out with her for a bit, but instead he was looking at his phone, he was mean to her, and now He's like this. He do be looking cozy though. He looks like a blue burrito. <laughs> oh man, it's nap time for Justin. Justin! <laughs> oh, okay, I'm here, okay. crying <laughs> that's actually really sad all she wanted was for someone to love her <laughs> and she made him cookies and she invited him over and she has all these photos of him and and, and he just ignored her <laughs> oh Justin lost a heart oh it's okay that's messed up bro little kitty cat just wanted to show him what's important your granny's important man right <sighs> That made me cry, bro. <laughs> Next video! Okay, this is a really sad animated video about a puppy! No, man. What is this zombie outbreak? Final video, guys. Don't cry. Is that a zombie? Wait, this reminds me of an adventure in the Lucky Box Plushie when I was supposed to leak that. Whatever. Dude. <laughs> Okay, he's got a photo of himself and his doggy before he turned to a zombie, it looks like. Wow, okay, got it. And that's his doggy? Yeah, so the grandpa's now a zombie, but the dog is not. Oof, friends. Oh, no. Oh, no. Tell me the doggy not going to oof. <laughs> so the dog is saying hi to his old owner. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, guys, sometimes Justin barks with the next door dog. <laughs> I always win. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Aww. He, he wants to be had his tummy scratched. Yeah, because the grandpa probably used to do that before he turned to a zombie. <laughs> Oh, his arm popped off. Kill you, zombie. Oh, they're playing fetch. Aww. They're chewing on bones of zombies. 
He petting his, his doggies. Wow, they're friends again. <laughs> Why'd you show me this? I don't pick these videos. Why'd you do that? Why, why'd you do that? I, I thought it was gonna be a cute video. Why, 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 why would you do that? I thought it was gonna be a cute video. Why, why would you do that? I thought it was gonna be a cute video. <laughs> Wait, we gotta see it, Justin. He just oofed his own doggy. <laughs> Is the dog a zombie? Wow, now the dog's a zombie and they lived happily ever after. Oh. This is Bunzo Bunny's funeral. Oh, don't cry, guys, or you lose a heart. I'm already gonna cry. It's mommy. <gasps> what? They all miss Bunzo. Why is Bunzo Bunny oofed? Oh, no. Who did this? He ate too many carrots. No. No! Are you kidding me? No. Huggy no, 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 no. Oh, look no. how sad Huggy Wuggy is. They're carrying the oof body. Buds up, honey. Don't, who did this? Don't who, cry. Who oof buds up? This is so sad. Just a little snuffle. A little. <gasps> There's oh, Daddy Long Legs. Daddy Long Legs. It's Poppy. Like... Everybody's so sad. Wait, I'm actually gonna cry. Oh, no. I'm not joking, guys. I'm actually gonna cry. No! What's up? Oh, Justin lost the heart. I was so sad when I saw Huggy Wuggy cry. I just wanted to cry. Oh, no! oh, oh, oh this is really sad. Oh, I lost the heart. This is really sad, man. Everybody's paying their respects. Even Broad, man. Even the Boogie Bot. Even the Cat B. Candy Cat. Ah. Oh, no, are you kidding me? He's an angel. this oh it's Danny long legs wait is boyfriend gonna get oof what is he doing what is he what are you doing oh my goodness guys boyfriend Justin are you okay bro boyfriend just got oof it's all of his memories it's a flashback yeah. they're doing a little pranky box he's having memories oh they were all such good friends <laughs> Now she's gonna have a flashback of when her and boyfriend were doing something fun together. He was there to help her up. He was there to help with a new lunch. Wow. Oh my goodness. Oh, that's sad, bro. They're all sharing their best memories of boyfriend. I'm getting tingles. This is so sad. She was sick or something. Boyfriend probably brought her up some chicken noodles. Oh, I love you, mom. Oh, that's so sad. All right, I lost like half a heart there. It's because the mommy, even Sonic.exe, misses boyfriend. Oh, because he's so lonely. Because he's boyfriend, you know what I mean? Right, everyone loves boyfriend. Oh my goodness. That almost got me when it is, I realized that earlier one was his mommy. Right. Sonic fell in love with boyfriend. Wow, that's so sad. It's Pico. Oh my goodness. They're, are they playing? Or they're playing tag. He's chasing him. They're not playing tag. Uh, they're trying to blast. This is always got a rocket launcher like Henry Stickman. Wow, that is so sad. And they both got oof. Guys. They both go oof, oof. Guys, they were best it's friends. Oof, oofity. <laughs> so they were playing a game of some sort. I don't think so. Oh, wow. They all have their memories, man. Why Why did Daddy Dearest do this? Why is he punching him, bro? He doesn't want boyfriend to date his daughter. That's why? Yeah, he doesn't want him to date girlfriend. Guys, that's sad. That's crazy. That's so crazy, man. They shared an umbrella. He said, you can stand under my umbrella. Ella. No, what? Ella. Yeah, guys. No, they didn't say that. All right, guys. What's going on? What? And they got a blade. Oh, I don't know what's going on, but I feel sad, man. And they love each other. Wow, everyone loves each other. It's oh. even oh, Mickey.avi. No. Oh, he gets no, sad. Oh, no, oh, no, oh. no, no, Mickey, no! What is Mickey doing? He Mickey! Didn't he didn't see the train. Boyfriend saved his life. He would have oofed. 
Boyfriend, boyfriend is such a good guy, man. If it wasn't for boyfriend, this is, don't cry, Adam. Don't, don't cry. I know, Adam, he, he's starting to snuffle. He's starting to snuffle. This is what he does when he runs out. <laughs> Origin story of Bunzo Bunny and PJ Pugapillar. Oh, it's Mommy Long Legs. It looks like everyone's uh, playing tag or having fun or something. This is gonna get sad. Oh, there's a uh, Kitty Cat and the player. Oh, they're all having fun. Everything looks happy now, guys, but watch out. This is gonna get so sad. We've both cried so many times. This is so sad. Oh. Okay, they're all buddies. Oh, they all love each other. Okay. All right, that's good at least. Okay. She got candy for everybody. Lollipop, lollipop. No way. Uh oh. What? What? Hey, yo, Poppy? Wait, what? Are they evil? No, they're, oh, they're sleeping. They're sleeping. They're sleeping. Oh, you thought they were oof? I thought they were oof. Oh. I thought they were oof. Yeah, guys, so far this is all happy. Is that the prototype? What was that? The oh, prototype? No. He's tickling her. He tickled mommy to oof. And that's like the janitor of the, of the factory. He just tickled on her. Wow, guys, don't ever do that. That's how I win all the fights. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> Wait, what's They're happening? They're wondering where their mommy is. Oh no. Hmm. Oh, no. She's in a cage, bro. Okay, this is getting pretty scary, guys. Oh no, they're what gonna are they run. What are they doing to her, bro? They're gonna run <clears throat> experiments on her. Don't run <clears throat> experiments on her. <laughs> this is nuts. She oof! Don't stop! She's good. She oof. He, oh my goodness! They're about to give Mommy Longlegs the prototype arms. Oh, please. with the oof on them. Don't surgical her, <laughs> guys. This is not cool. I'm gonna tickle on you. <laughs> you don't stop the Nazi. <laughs> it's not a try not to laugh. It's a try not to cry. Don't cry. They're gonna save Mommy. They say that was Bunzo Bunny through a symbol. They're it's heroes. Like, it's like the evil CEO. Oh, they're, but they're they're scared. You see, their legs are shaking. And he's gonna give them like uh, lollipops. Don't fall for it. It's poison. It's poison. It's poison. Yeah. Don't fall for it. Candy Cat. Candy Cat is weak. They love candy. He tried to oh, PJ Pugapo trying to save Candy Cat. He's saying no. Don't eat that lollipop. You're candy Cat just eat it. Oh no. He no. He betrayed his own friend. He just realized what he just did. Oh my. No, God. they both fell in. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> And he's just laughing. He he just laughing. I'm literally getting tingles, guys. This is so sad. He's just laughing. And that's her babies. Oh wow. That's her babies. Half her babies are just gone now. He just oof half the baby. That's not cool, guys. This is crazy. And they're still player. Bro! Hey, player and buzzer try to save their mommy. But that guy just laughing. No, run, 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 run. Open run, the cage, run, nice. Run, 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 run. Here we go, nice. Oh, the poison trying to save her. All of her babies fell oof in the oof. Guys, that is and not oof cool. in the prototype oof. <laughs> and now she's crying at the and cemetery. Oh, no! What's this? Oh, it's a chicken versus everyone in Minecraft. Run, little guy. So it's him and his chicken. He just trapped him in there. It's a big chicken. He's trying to fight the steam. He's gonna sacrifice himself for the chicken. He, he loves his chicken. Wow. He loves his baby. Wow, guys, that is so cool. He loves his baby. Right, guys, chickens are, wow. He loves his baby. Look at the sunset, guys. He and he's do, having memories of saving his baby. He, he would do anything to save. I would do anything to save my babies. Yeah, guys, Justin does not have babies. <laughs> <laughs> but maybe one day. <laughs> oh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. You're making a mockery of us. <laughs> one day, Justin might become a dad. I don't know. What are you even <laughs> saying? Go! Go home! <laughs> Go! <laughs> Get that big booty out of here. <laughs> now, what's this? It's Sonic and Tails. They're at the bottom of the ocean. No. They've been chained up at the bottom of the ocean. Why is it so blurry? Because they're just waking up. They're, oh, they're like passed out. They're running out of oxygen. Oh, it's an animation, guys. Sonic woke up. 
Tails is still sleeping. He sees that he's chained down at the bottom of the ocean. They're both gonna oof underwater. Oh, uh, what? I think so, if he doesn't get oxygen in time. Nice, okay, Tails got a little bit of oxygen from that bubble. They both just woke up, they're hugging. Nice. They know it's their last moments. Oh, wow. Don't cry, Aiden. Because I don't think Sonic can breathe underwater. And he always hugs his mommy. He says, you never know when this might be the last hug, mommy. Right? And he says, you never not by my side. <laughs> to his own mommy. <laughs> right? Right, guys? <laughs> right? <laughs> right? <laughs> Alright guys. Wait, what what's happening? Tails just oofed. He's throwing a blade. No no the blade he like he let go because he oofed. Oh. He's trying to cut the chain, but he couldn't. He needs that bubble. And there's one bubble left. He Tails saved it for Sonic. It's an air bubble, guys. Oh wow. No. He no. saved the last air bubble for his friend. No, guys. No. Oh, there's a lot more. Never mind. What's Sonic doing? Sonic is letting go also of the blade. They've given up. They just gave up. Both of them. He said, if my friend oofs, I'm gonna oof, man. Wow. If Adam oofed, I would oof. That's so heartbreaking. Aw, that's so sad. But not for me. We are doing a try not to cry challenge. Okay, now I picked out two videos that I want to show you today. And our only goal is to not cry. <laughs> I don't cry. <laughs> oh, this is the <laughs> no cry zone. <laughs> no cry zone. Okay. I'm not a baby. <laughs> I'm not a baby. I thought when I looked over, uh, I thought it said no fry zone. Yeah, that too. No, <laughs> no, actually, no. I'm a fry. No, definitely a fry zone. I'm not. A, I'm not a baby. So it is a fry zone, but not it's a, a no cry, cry zone. zone. I'm gonna up the ante for myself. Okay. It's a no cry and no laugh challenge. I will not laugh. I will not. Laugh. No laughing, or no crying. Cry. Or if you lose, you have to buy me some of the new merch from Lanky Box Shop. <laughs> what? You lost. <laughs> you lost, no, bro. It's, it's crying, not laughing. It's laughing for me and crying. Fine. I will not laugh Put or my cry. my serious face. <laughs> I'm not going to cry. I'm not a baby. <laughs> I don't cry. Okay, let's get into it. Okay, now it's K9 University. Now this film's called Pip, guys. We will link everything down below. Hey, let's go. Okay. Okay, it's a guide dog school. It's where they train dogs to be guide dogs. Okay. Oh. Okay. Oh, that's probably Pip. Uh, you think so? Oh, it's like a golden retriever. Oh, like a okay. Lab. Okay. He kind of okay. Oh, got pushed to the side, but he's happy. Hey, hey, he chilling. So far, I'm feeling really happy. This is really cute, but I know my heart is about to break. Okay. Okay. Ace takes first place. So he's looking up to. <laughs> I can't look at you or else I'm going to start laughing. Okay, the ace takes first place. <laughs> Almost made me laugh. He looked... <laughs> <laughs> you no, no! You bro! No, no, That's what no, no, edit that out. No, edit guys, out. in the comments... Edit that out. Count how many times Justin laughed or cried. Edit that out. He just looks so serious, yeah. though. <laughs> okay, He so. looks like me right now. <laughs> I don't laugh. This ain't no funny time. <laughs> And I don't cry. <laughs> okay, so this is like his hero. Okay, Ace saves the oh, day so Ace, again. Ace is just, he's hes balling. Ace, Ace is like the Superman of guide dogs. Dude, Ace, he, he's the VIP, he's the MVP here. He saved the day again. Okay, Ace. So okay, maybe Ace. Pip wants to be like Ace. Oh, I got you, I got you. Okay. okay. Oh, Pip. Oh, wow. Huh? Oh, no. Oh, there's a height limit. Oh, Pip. No. <laughs> Pip. Pip is too small to go to the academy. Yeah, what if they turned the height on its side? Then, <laughs> then he could... <laughs> because he's so thick, thick Pip, you know? What are you talking about? <laughs> what, what are you actual... What are you actual... I, well, I don't laugh. What I don't, don't cry. I would love to see an x-ray of your brain. Oh. And just see what oh. goes on. <laughs> Oh, it's lit up. It's it would it's be Liddy. glowing. It it's Liddy in there. Yeah. You have failed the laugh challenge about a hundred times. You best hope you don't cry. I'm, I'm winning gonna this cry challenge. Tears of laughter. Don't. Okay, so Pip is too short. Okay. Oh, he oh no. so he can't go to school. Oh, he's trying to. Oh, Pip. Bruh. That's so sad. That's actually so sad. Is she gonna let him through anyways? Oh, oh nice. He cheated. Pip. He, he didn't cheat. <laughs> okay. Pip he used his brain. Oh, okay. Pip, Pip, real excited. Pip man. got in. 
Oh, what? That's it's over? No, no, no. That's just the Ben and Gin. Oh, 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 that's just the title. Yeah. I was like, that's it? Okay. Bruh. So they're learning how to walk around. Oh, whoa. Oh, they're in a little classroom. Oh, Pip. Go through the cones, Pip. Okay, he's nice. zooming, he's zooming. Oh, he's look, zooming. he's strutting. He's zooming, he's zooming. He's so confident. Yo, no, Pip, what are you doing, bro? Oh, he led the owner into the into the obstacle. I mean, I look, I'm trying to not feel bad, but at the same time, he's so confident. He's yeah. Like, he's like, hey, easy, uh, hey, easy. He's not even looking where he's going. Yeah. Come on, Pip. Oh, no. Pip. Is he gonna fail? I hope not. Okay, no. they're pressing a the button to get some food. Okay. Pip, hey, that's pip, too much. Hey, pip like me, hey, hey, <laughs> hey, hey, keep it going, hey. <laughs> let me get some seconds. Oh why no! Is pip, why is he so confident? Pip, look at his face. He's like, hey, I got this, yo. Oh, he's Come working on, pip. so hard hey, though. Pip's trying his best. He's growing. Oh, Still yeah. doesn't learn how to turn off the phone. Oh, ouch! Bruh. Oh, pip, bruh. Oh, he's worried. He's like, I'll never be like Ace. Oh, bruh, bruh, this photo though. <laughs> don't look at it, Justy. Don't look at it. Don't look at Ace. You oh, better not laugh. No. Okay. Ace leads the pack. Oh, Pip's got an idea. What is okay. it? Okay, more food. Oh, food. okay. Once again, thinking okay. outside okay, the he's box. Learning. He's learning. Nice. What? Oh, he, he he used his books to sit on. Oh. Okay, so he's he's adapting. Oh, he's getting better. Nice job, Pip. Well, let's go, Pip. Let's go. Oh no, is this gonna have a sad ending? Oh, it's ending? the final test, Okay, it's bruh. exam day. Oh, bruh. Pip, go up there. Alright, hey, Pip first. Get an A, Pip get first. an A. Pip first. Okay. Come on, Pip, don't mess up. There you go. Okay, okay, yeah, okay, he's zooming. He be zooming, though. Nice. He do be zooming. Good job, Pip. Oh, no, Pip! What are you, what are oh, you doing? No! Pip! Dude, she took a tumble. Get man. up, Pip! <laughs> what is he doing? He was doing so well. Why, why? He was looking at his, his, his owner. You got distracted, Pip. You dropped the ball. And I ain't, I'm not saying that because he's a dog. Oh, no. Wait, oh, is he going to fail? Bruh. Nah, Pip, nah, get up, Pip. Hey, oh, fall she's, down. She's not happy. Hey, as long as you... Bruh, he really got kicked out of school, though. Oh, there's Ace. Oh, he's going to look at the Ace statue. Don't look at it, Pip. Just don't look. Don't look. Bruh. <laughs> oh, wait. There's someone that needs his help. Oh, true. Oh. Oh, he's outside the school. He's not allowed oh, in. Oh, oh. Oh, it's turning oh, to. Oh, I thought that was rain, but it was his tears. Oh. It was his tears. No! No! Get it together! Are you okay? No! I will not cry. Okay. Wait, before we keep going, guys, go check out Lanky Box Shop. We're doing a new contest where you can win a video from Boxy and Foxy. For every $10 you spend, that, that's one contest entry. You can head to the website to see all the details. There's lots of awesome stuff. Go over to Lanky Box Shop. Man, Foxy says, bruh. Oh, boy. Pip, don't cry. Don't cry. Oh, man. Oh, man. Is she in trouble? Oh, yo, she's in a dangerous construction zone. Run, Pip. Bruh. Oh, because he's so small, he can get out. Oh, and the other ones can't. He's using his size to his okay, advantage. Okay, he's helping. He's help. He do be helping. Oh. He do be zooming. Pip, why that way? Oh, he's leading her to safety. Okay. Okay. Oh, I'm actually getting chills. Nice, Pip. Nice, nice, nice. Nice, Pip. Nice. <gasps> wow. And everyone saw. No way. Are they going to give him Ace's cake? No way. No way. Whoa. Pip be zooming on him. Aha. Pip he's even posing like, like Ace. Our dog saved it. Oh, this is so sad. <laughs> Are you okay? Don't cry, Justy! <laughs> Don't do it! Stop laughing! What is... What's so funny? What are you doing? Don't laugh! Why are you in this outfit? Why? It's a no cry zone! So you wear this every time you don't want to cry? Yeah! 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 Okay, I'm not even gonna question. Don't laugh, don't cry, Justy! Uh, no. Okay, you okay. got another video for us to watch? I have one more. Go Let's ahead and pull go. it. Let's go! Okay, now this is the next video. I took off my outfit. It was getting way too hot in there. Okay, this one's called, What Would Christmas Be Without Love? <laughs> well, it would still be Christmas. But other than that, let's check out the okay, video. Okay, No crying, no tears. I won't. 
Oh, oh it's man. a little porcupine. Oh, yo, is, is that Foxy? <laughs> Foxy be zooming. She zooming. Okay, is that me with the glasses? Okay. Oh, the teacher is a little little hedgehog. Yeah, a little I think he's a student. Oh, okay. He's trying to get to his oh, desk, bro. Oh. but he's got the quills on his back. Yeah. Oh. Oh, oh a little squirrel's being nice. Squirrel. Wow, this animation. Si oh. <laughs> oh, they don't like Everyone, him. Why is everybody being mean to him? Because he's pointy. They don't want to get Cause, pointed. Oh, because he's the new kid in class. The new kid. Know? Yo, but if he rolled up in our new back to school merch, though, he'd be looking pretty good. He would have lit. some swag. Oh, oh bro. He got rejected. That's savage. Why are these kids so mean, man? Oh. Now he's sitting there. Oh, he might play soccer with someone. Oh, please, no. I, I can tell where this is going. He's going to pop the soccer ball. Bruh. Please don't do don't. it. Don't do it. Bruh. Bruh. Oh, bruh. It, bruh. it popped. Bruh. Wait, we got to keep don't going. Cry. Don't cry! Okay, I think the squirrel's gonna be his friend. Oh, yo, this pig, yo, this little pig or whatever this is, is kind of mean, man. Yeah, it's a piggy. Yeah, it's kind of mean. Okay, hey, the squirrel's waving. Aww. Oh, they're buddies. Oh! oh! They ran over a speed bomb. Um, oh, that's so sad. That's terrible. It's Christmas time. Wait, the Christmas squirrel is time. the squirrel's talking to people. Yo, were they gossiping? Oh man, oh man, oh man, that's sad. Wait. <laughs> They, they got him a present? I uh, I bet I know what it is. What do you think it is? <laughs> a new soccer ball. <laughs> <laughs> they all got him something as a class? Yeah. Bruh. Some packing peanuts. Is the gift packing peanuts? Oh. Wait, it's empty. The gift is the peanuts. Oh, they're going to put the packing peanuts on the end of his sticks. <laughs> Wait, no, Don't keep going. Laugh. <laughs> Don't laugh. Keep Justin. going. And now they can hug him and not get hurt. Aww. Ha! It's the Rainbow Friends. There's a giant Rainbow Friend. What are they running from? Oh, no. Come on, Green. Keep up. Red, why is this happening? Another one of your crazy experiments? This isn't my fault this time. Yeah. Likely. Huh? Green. Oh my goodness! Oh. Don't cry, Aid. Wait, I lost a life. Don't cry. Why is this? It's a giant rainbow, rainbow friend taking everybody's colors, bro. Oh. Taste the rainbow. Ayo, 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 There's still time to fix this. I know it. Uh. Orange, glad to see you're safe. These rainbow creatures are everywhere. They already got pink and yellow. I don't know how much more of this we can take. Come with me. We'll get to my lab and work on a way to fix all of this. Lead the way! What? Uh, nice try, but you can't escape the rainbow. Orange, no! Bruh. Let him go. No! So guys, all of the rainbow friends are having their colors stolen and Justin cried. That means he loses a life too. Why are they doing this? So they, they're taking all the colors and then they turn them back into rainbow. This is nuts, bro. Give me my color back. No, no, no. Oh, taste the rainbow. Mmm, <laughs> pretty tasty. Red, you gotta try this. I should have known you couldn't help but gorge yourself. Yeah. Very well. I will solve this alone. First green, and now orange. This rainbow monster was going to destroy the rainbow friends one by one if I didn't find a way to stop it. Thankfully, hope arrived with the appearance of purple. Red, down here. Purple, you're alive. Whoa! That's right. Once the others started going nuts, I took to my vents quickly. You gotta get to your lab, right? To make this all go away? That's the plan. No problemo. It's this way. Follow me. Whoa! They're going to Red's lab to fix this. No way. Here we are. Hey, what the- No! Oh, oh. Give me your cover. 
Purple actually got his color stolen. <laughs> oh man, we both lost a heart. Now, brothers, prepare for feast. <laughs> the beast had me cornered, but I wasn't about to go down without a fight. Are you ready to accept your fate? No, I won't let you turn me into one of your mindless monsters. You don't have a choice. Take this! Oh! They're fighting! Nice. Don't fight. Do it with water. Whoa! It washed off all the rainbow, Brain! That's really cool! Fred, you saved me! Leo, you're the rainbow monster? That's right. But thanks to you, I'm myself again. Blue, listen to me very carefully. All of the rainbow friends are still very much in danger. Why don't you tell me what happened, so I can better think of a way to save them. We don't have much time. Well, okay then. It's all my fault, Red. Let me start at the beginning. The other day, when I was doing my daily routine of patrolling, looking for humans to hunt, I passed by all the others. The Rainbow Friends were in a really bad place. Everyone's just feeling so bummed out. Sure, becoming a Rainbow Friend has given them awesome powers, but there's a lot of limitations too. I'll start with myself first. I may be big and strong now, way more so than when I was a pathetic human. I also gained some cool new friends. I even get to spend more time with my sister. But there's a lot of drawbacks. I didn't want to mention it because of green and all, but this button eye of mine, I can't see out of it. My depth perception is all out of whack. Not only that, but this perpetual slobber is really annoying. It's always dripping into my drinks. Disgusting. My body is so big and bulky that I'm always hitting my head on door frames. Not to mention the seats in the theater are super uncomfy. Oh, <laughs> oh that's the worst. That's not funny. That's sad. He got so many things he can't do. Yeah, right, guys. That is pretty oh, sad. Uh, oh, Justin lost half a heart there. Yeah, being blue is hard. But it's nothing compared to the others, like Orange. I talked to him that day, and he had his own troubles. I used to be big. I could eat and eat and never get tired of eating. Nowadays, I can only eat on a set feeding schedule. Not to mention I'm so small, I have to ask the other taller rainbow friends to reach things for me. I can't even be independent. Sure, I'm a cool dinosaur, and I should be thankful for that. But aren't dinos supposed to be big? I can't help but wonder if there's something that could have been done about this. I wanted to learn more, so I headed to the vents. What's that? You want to know what's got me down? Well, what doesn't? I'm forced to crawl around these vents like a filthy rat. I had enough of the slimy underbelly when I was a human. My whole existence is like a big joke. I went to see Green, and his struggles were the most obvious of all. Where do I begin? Well, I'm blind, duh. But also, these short stubby legs and long arms make my balance a nightmare. I feel like one of those wacky, waving, inflatable, arm flailing tube men you see outside of car dealerships. Oh, it's sad, bro. All the Rainbow Friends have problems, man. I actually feel so sad right now because the Rainbow <laughs> Friends, everyone's so scared of them, but they're all so sad. Oh. Orange would be so happy if he could just eat the Leggy Box Kitchen. And, and green has short legs and purple has to go in the sewers all day. It's so sad. It's not easy being a rainbow friend, eh? Not at all, guys. It ain't easy being green. That's for sure. Everyone had their fair share of problems with being the specific color of rainbow friend that they were. But I thought to myself, if red made us into these things, maybe there's a way we could be made into something else. So I snuck into your lab while you were out having your morning tea, and from there, I got to work. I used the machine to combine my body with the essences of color you keep stored. First, I mixed with green's essence. I emerged from the machine as Cyan, a brand new rainbow friend. First thing I noticed was that my eye was fixed. I also had the long stretchy arms of green, and I wasn't drooling anymore either. It was amazing. But I was still facing green's balance issues, so I decided to take it a step further. I combined myself with the essence of purple. I became a beautiful violet rainbow friend. 
From here, I assumed the hunch posture of purple, thereby eliminating my top heavy issue. Now I could travel in style! I decided to give the vents a whirl, and boy, I sure could move fast through them! I knew that this was the cure to all of my friend's problems. If I could just get the mixes right, we'd remain ourselves, just without the drawbacks. But, I might have gone a little overboard. I combined myself with all of the colors of the rainbow at once. I had hoped this would morph me into some kind of super being. A small part of me believed it might even make me human again. Instead, I became the rainbow monster you encountered. I had all the colors within me, but that still wasn't enough. I needed everyone else's essence of color too. Only by draining it from them, could I give them the gift of the rainbow. Oh, that's so sad, man. He just wanted to be human. Wow. And instead, he ran a bunch of experiments on himself and turned himself into a monster. Wow. Essence of color too. Only by draining it from them, could I give them the gift of the rainbow. At least, this is what my head was telling me. The colors had completely taken over, and I was more beast than friend. You already know the rest. I took green, orange, and purple's colors already. And I nearly took yours too. Until you saved me. Wait, how did you save me again? Let us in. Come on. You gotta taste the rainbow. It's a gift like none other. The steam from the pipe blew. The water vapors were what returned you to normal. Of course, it's so simple. Hmm, water was the cure all along? So, should we give the other rainbow friends a bath? Exactly. Well, not exactly, but close enough. They'll be through that door in no time. Quick, help me set a fire. What? Are you crazy? Trust me. Okay, if you say so. Fire! Aha! We got you now. Watch out! Huh? What? Not today. Oh, fire alarm! Oh, the water! No! no! It burns! It burns! You're going back to normal! Yeah! It worked! Everyone's back to normal! Nah, it's in the sewage. No way. Hey, yo! There are many ways to interpret all the letters in the alphabet. For instance, A could stand for apples, an amazing and appetizing treat. B could be for a big, beautiful butterfly fluttering through the sky. And C could be all sorts of things. Calm. C. Courageous. C. Cowardly. C. Crazy. C. Or even cool. C. But all too often, D has stood for death. Oh, what? Yes. Oh, bro. Guys, do not cry. Every time I think of... Yeah. I feel like I'm gonna cry, bro, because everyone picked on it. Exactly, guys. This is an extreme try not to cry challenge. Me and Justin both have five lives. Every time we cry, we lose a heart. Don't cry! This is a story about the most evil of all the letters, F, and how it became the villain it is today. You see, F had started to attack various seemingly random letters of the alphabet, picking them off one by one. He started locking up his victims in handcuffs deep inside the caverns of his mountain fortress. D and E had no idea why they were being taken captive, but clearly something was wrong with F. He had changed from when they were young and not for the better. Now, this is sad because we know the full story of the, alpha uh, the alphabet lore, bro. Right, guys, don't cry. Everybody picked on F and he was just sticking up for Anne. <laughs> Oh, we both lost one! Wow. Of course, there were those who looked to end his reign of terror. <laughs> G called out with his horn to enlist the help of his ABC allies. Cab. <laughs> Together, they formed a cab and swore to track down F to the ends of the earth. Uh oh. But they were too late to save H. His faint, ghostly body faded away like dust in the wind. Oh! And even that was a better fate than that of I. I. The poor little guy was jumped on and squashed repeatedly, eventually becoming a diabolical weapon used by F against the other alphabet letters. Oh my goodness, I never realized I felt bad for I, bro. He got squashed and then F turned him against his own friend. That actually is so sad. Guys, we have a ton of insanely sad videos to watch with you guys. Don't cry. 
J was incinerated instantly, never to be heard from again. Now! While K was left in a state of shock, having just witnessed the death of his dearest friend. But F would have no mercy on him. He forced K to become a set of rapid flapping wings that allowed him to soar through the air. Meanwhile, G, C, A, and B drove furiously towards the chaos in order to defeat F and his new unwilling partners. Though, when they finally arrived, they discovered I was too powerful. He charged up an enormous shot enough to wipe them all from the alphabet for good. G, C, A, and B huddled together, bracing for certain death. Luckily for them, L showed up to save the day just in the nick of time, along with his entire group of superheroes, LMNOP. Bro, it's LMNOP, bruh. Okay, let's see what happens here. Bro, I'm gonna cry if gets oofed, man. You see, they were seen as the protectors of the alphabet. Each of them had a very special gem that gave them immense power. M was able to break K free from F using his super strength, allowing him to fly away to safety. Bruh. But the attacks of N and O were much less successful, barely doing any kind of damage. When it was P's turn to attack, everyone was mesmerized, particularly G, Bruh. who had been in love with her for as long as he could remember. Bruh. F used the distraction as a chance to steal N's semicolon gem. With his new power in hand, he retreated back to his cavernous lair, locking up I away for good. After losing the semicolon crystal, N became normal once again. Disgusted by his failure, L and O flew away. Oh, it's gonna make me sad, bro, because I'm thinking about L and O picking on N when they were little lowercase alphabet landers. Very true, guys. This is gonna get very sad. One letter in particular, Q, frantically crawled towards the other letters. He seemed desperate to tell them something. But his slow, snail-like body never allowed him to fully reach them. It didn't take long for F to claim another victim. He attacked R and dragged him back to his fortress with I, E, and D. With F lost again, the others needed direction. The letters M, A, and P came together to form a map for G to track down F's location. He was heading straight for S. Nah. Try as they might, the heroes were too late to save S. No! The letter had been eaten by F, slurped down like a spaghetti noodle. No! L and O were the first to arrive. They tried to stop F in his tracks with their magical auras. But F had become too powerful. He easily shrugged off their attacks using the semicolon gem he stole from N earlier, and wasted no time collecting the colon and period gems from L and O. He felt all the force energy of the punctuation crystals flowing through him. Soon, no one would be strong enough to defeat him, and his plan would be complete. No, bro, F is not evil, bro, he's nice. This video is crazy. Bro, he's getting oof T, man. After that, F attacked T, smashing him like a hammer into the ground. The other letters tried to stand up to F, but not even M in all his super strength could do any damage to him. F stole M's comma crystal. The only one that stood even the slightest chance was P. She bolted around with supersonic speed, thanks to her exclamation point gem. She was able to land several mighty blows against F, knocking him down to the ground. Still, she was no true match for him. As she charged up her beam attack, F was able to strike her with the comma freeze ray he had just stolen from M, leaving her locked in time. F has won. With four of the six punctuation gems in hand, he possessed abilities no other letter would dare to fight. That is, except for C, who had always been brave in the face of danger. Man, C is so brave, bro. He chopped F, bro. Oh, man, guys. But, but now C might pay the price. Yeah. Unfortunately, that was his undoing. F viciously attacked C, shredding him like old newspaper. F's work here was done. He flew away with P. The others mourn the loss of their friend C, but realize that if they were to ever defeat F, they would have to get creative. Bah, 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 bah. G and M join forces with you in order to form a weapon. Surely, this would be the answer to all their problems, right? One blast and their nightmare could be all over. They fire at F just as he was about to attack V. A direct hit. G, U, and N all rejoice. No. It was finally over. No. 
until they realized F had more tricks up his sleeve. Somehow, he was able to disguise P as himself. <laughs> another heart guys that is so sad i know wow g hadn't saved the day he had shot his love and with that a new word inside n's mind is formed coward n thought back to everyone that had died or been captured how no one was able to save them including elemental p the supposed saviors of this realm how was he going to stand up to F now? Meanwhile, F went back to his mountain to prepare for the final phase of his evil plan before being stopped in his tracks by X. X, X was a noble warrior. His beaming asterisk gem glistened in the air. His special power was the ability to clone himself. Identical copies of X started to spread out far and wide, surrounding F in waves. The strategy worked. F was perplexed by the clones. He had no idea where to attack, so he surrendered his gems. Being the chivalrous ninja he was, X obliged and put down his gem as well, revealing the true X. But chivalry can also be foolish. Without the element of surprise, X was quickly dispatched by F and his mighty jaws. And with him defeated, F was able to steal his crystal. Now only one punctuation gem remained out of his grasp. As Y mourned the loss of X, F began to set his trap. He plopped against the sides of the wall, creating oozing puddles of disgusting black goo. Ah! Then he vomited up S, locking him and R in chains alongside I, E, and D. Clearly, he was trying to spell out something. It seemed that F no longer needed the gems. The crystals placed themselves along the path inside the mountain as a sort of trail heading straight for F. The other letters cautiously entered, and Transfix started to pick up the gems one by one as his team was slowly picked apart. M, U, G, A, all taken away by the gross black darkness spread by F. It seemed as if N would be next. A giant set of sharp teeth filled the tunnel like a flood, and N was forced to flee. But instead of killing N, it led him all the way to F's inner sanctum. N wasted no time retrieving the last of the punctuation gems and transforming into his final form, unleashing an attack of rainbow energy directly at F. He's gonna oop F, but that's his friend! Bruh. No! Full time. And had done it. He defeated F with the power of love. Or was it actually the power of evil? As N got closer, he finally realized what F was trying to spell. The word friends. Ah! Oh! F just wanted some friends, bro. what F was planning, except the wise Q, who had finally managed to catch up to the others. Q explained to everyone the prophecy he had foretold long ago. F and the other letters used to be younger, so young in fact, that they were all lowercase, and everyone got along, playing and dancing. That is, of course, until L and O decided to beat up N. L launched O like a slingshot towards the sad little letter and then mocked his insignificance. F, being the good friend he was, decided to pull off a hilarious prank as revenge. He corralled up the letter A R and T to help him spell fart. The gross flatulence as a result was loud and stinky enough to be heard throughout the entire alphabet, even killing H. But L and O would not be made fools of. They smacked F around, stomping and squishing him. It was so sad that the tears F cried became hard and crystallized into the punctuation gems we know today. They all teamed up to beat up F even more, punching him around, blasting out his teeth, even tripping him. F continued to cry. His final tear became the question mark crystal, the last gem to be completed. It seemed like no one cared for F anymore, so he ran away to the mountain in solitude. 
As the years passed, Af grew older and more bitter. He became an uppercase letter and started preparing his scheme. Deep down, Af wasn't evil. He was just lonely and heartbroken and wanted nothing more to be loved once again by his old friends. <laughs> Guys, that is why it is so important in life to have friends. Because if you don't have friends, what do you have? Exactly, Justin. Oh man, so we both lost another heart. This is so sad, man. You see, it's important to realize that no one letter is good or bad. They all come together to make something bigger than themselves. And Alphabet United can quickly become untied. And the real fun so easily turns into funeral. Oh! In the end, the alphabet is what you make of it. And some of the deepest wounds can only be cured by time. And some restful sleep. Wow, bro! This video will totally make you cry, Bambolina! I will never cry, Linky Box. Whoa! <gasps> it's Buzzo Buddy! Huh? It's Mommy, she's watching. What? <gasps> Bunzo's having a flashback. <gasps> oh no, this is like the sad origin of Bunzo. This is so sad. Mommy's watching him. There's oof everywhere. Oh my goodness. Huh? Dangerous. She turned huh? him into a monster. Don't, Mommy. Don't turn him into a monster. <gasps> oh, she's watching. She's watching him go down. <gasps> Here comes Bunzo. Uh oh. Bruh. There's <gasps> Bunzo. Uh. Oh, Bunzo used to be friendly. Aww. <gasps> and she didn't like that at all. Bro, Bunzo used to be friends with PJ Pugapillar and Poppy. Oh, this is so sad. Wait, guys, I'm so close to crying. This is so bad. He ran into mommy. She doesn't want him to be nice. She said, you gotta be angry like this photo. But he just wants a hug. Oh, this is so oh, it's sad. Okay, guys, I cried a little bit. Oh, well, she played hide and seek with him. But it's actually a trap, bro. Oh, she's hiding. What is she doing? Guys, no, no, it's no, PJ no. It's PJ Pugapillar. What's gonna happen, bro? It's gonna get so sad, bro. Oh, bruh, bruh, she lured him away from his friends so she could turn him mean. Guys, check this out. Oh, no, this oh, is not good. Oh, my goodness, she tied him up, bro. <gasps> and then she put him there, bro. Oh, and there's like oof on his back. Oh, I'm crying. <laughs> Don't do it, Bunzo, no. He doesn't want to be a monster. <laughs> no, Bunzo. Okay, guys. Keep watching. This is where it gets really sad. She ate Why she took a chomp out of him? Even the crewmate said, Oh, I lost like three hearts. Guys, oh. both of us lost a bunch of hearts already. This is so sad. Oh my bruh. Now it's boyfriend and Pippi. They gotta fight the corruption. Pippi Glitch, girlfriend is corrupted. Oh no, that's his girlfriend who he loves, and now he has bruh. to oof her. Bro, a few moments ago, bruh, she got corrupted.exe. No. Tell me boyfriend doesn't have to oof his own girlfriend. Oh no, guys, no. <laughs> it's not funny, bro. <laughs> it's baby glitch, bro. Don't oof your own girlfriend, man. They're having a flashback to when they were happy. Oh, wow, they used to be just so in love. Oh, bro. Oh, there's Davey. What's he doing? Bro. Oh, wow. Each other. They're having flashbacks to all their memories together, all their memories. And now he gotta oof his own girlfriend because she got Pibby Corrupt glitch hacked. Don't do it, boyfriend. Don't. Oh, my heart hurts. He oofed her now. 
Now this story is about the man from the window. What's going on here? <gasps> what is that Bonzo Bunny? It's Bonzo Bunny versus the man from the window. Okay, Bonzo Bunny. <gasps> There's the man from the window. No, Bonzo, stay away, bro. He got kidnapped. Oh, man, now he's trapped. Bro, he got bunny napped, bro. And now his parents are going to be looking for him. His parents got yeeted. <gasps> he woke up. He's tied up, bro. Why does everyone keep tying up Bonzo? <laughs> I love Bonzo. Oh, my goodness. What is this? Oh, my goodness. They ate the player, too. Oh, wow. So now Bonzo and the player are trapped. Dude, the man from the window is like, he, 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 he. he's like making fun of them. <gasps> Bonzo's so strong, bro. Nice job, Bonzo. You escaped. Oh, my goodness. Run, Bonzo. <gasps> you got he tripped. it. Nah, he tripped, bro. bro. Oh, no. Oh, he passed out, bro. He got bonked. He's gonna bro. get tied up again. Bro, don't tie up Bunzo Bunny, bro. Get out, get out, get out. Your parents love you. Oh, my goodness. They're his mommy and daddy. His daddy pulling out a grab pack. His mommy and <laughs> daddy coming in. Bro, stop. Nice. All right. Oof, that guy. He's evil. Oh, oh, but he's actually sad. Oh, wait, guys, this is really sad. He got picked on at school. Bro, maybe he just had no friends. That's why he wanted Bonzo to be his friend. That's like me and Aiden, bro. Wow, guys, I, I'm actually bruh. so sad. Bro, this is so life-changing, bro. Now, Bonzo and Player are in the factory with Mommy. What's Mommy doing? She loved them all. Wow. She got some. She got candy. <gasps> What's gonna happen? Oh, bruh. There's Bonzo. Don't mess with Bonzo anymore. <gasps> it's the prototype. Oh, yo, oh, bruh. What is happening? Yo, hey, yo, who's that? Hey, yo, they used the prototype to oof mommy. What are they doing? <gasps> that is crazy. Bro, what's they got some lollipops? They're gonna eat them? No, don't eat them, bro. They might be uh, oofed. Right, guys. Oh, wow. Is mommy in a cage? Bro, what are they doing? What are they doing to her? <gasps> the prototype trying to oof mommy. And there's some oof coming from her hand now. They're gonna turn her into proto mommy. Oh, no. That is so scary. Oh, my goodness. Guys, we have a bonus secret video to show you at the end that we almost guarantee will make you cry. So make sure to stick around for that. Bro, all the friends came in to help save mommy. What? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Nah, they fell in the EXE. Oh, they all fell in the EXE. This guy, this evil guy's laughing. Oh, my goodness. This is Oh, bad. my goodness. Bonzo, save mommy, bro. Come on, Bonzo. We can do it. We can do it. Come on, Bonzo. Nah, it's too late. It's too late. Oh, no. Oh, they're all in the EXE. Oh, my goodness. This is so sad. All of her children turned EXE corrupted. They all out. Oh, there's mommy in the Schrader. Now, this is about the prototype fixing up mommy long legs. Okay, there's the prototype, guys. This is gonna get so sad. Bro, why? What are they doing, bro? <gasps> they turned her into proto mommy. No! Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Experiment on mommy. Oh, wow, guys. Okay, let's see what happens. Oh, the prototype's so creepy. Yo. It's like half human, half robot. Yo. What are they doing to mommy? Oh, they took her hair off. Wait, what? They're opening her brain. Oh, my goodness. Oh, that's gross. Oh, my goodness. And they gave her a new EXE brain. Now she's going to be cursed Mommy Longlegs. Bruh, she's going to be EXE Mommy Longlegs, bruh. Oh, wow, dude. This is so bad. Oh, my goodness. Now they got the Mommy body, and they're going to put EXE in there. Oh, they're pumping her full of EXE evil juice. Don't. Wow. Oh, wow. She's turning turning into a prototype evil. Bro, don't turn her into a prototype evil. Okay, guys, let's see what happens. This is going to Whatever get you do, never turn people into <laughs> prototype evils. Oh, my goodness. She's getting... 
zapped. <laughs> bro, it's not funny, bro. I'm close to crying, bro. Oh, bro. I'm on my last heart, bro. I can't cry, bro. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. It's mommy prototype evil. Now we got baby long legs and baby daisy. Okay, what are they doing? Oh, they got a little lollipop. There's baby daisy. It ate all the food. Hey. Oh, that's sad. Always share, guys. Bro, sharing is caring, bro. Right. Oh, there's daddy long legs. There's daddy. What's he doing, bro? <gasps> He about to be real angry. He lit Daisy on fire? Wow. Oh, no. It's Daddy Long Legs and Baby Long Legs. It's Baby Daddy. Baby Daddy also <laughs> stole the food? <laughs> What? He just got mad at Daisy for doing that. Now mommy is angry at Daisy. Wow, is she gonna light him on fire? Hey, yo, she chasing him! <laughs> hey, is this Red's lap? What's Purple doing in there? <laughs> Maybe Red will see he's not the only technological whiz around these parts. Purple? <gasps> what are you doing in Red's lap? Uh-oh, it seems like Purple is up to no good. He dropped the torch. Fire! Everyone, we gotta get out of here! Oh no! The fire's gonna spread! Don't cry, Foxy! Don't cry! Guys! Oh my god! That's what is going to happen to the Rainbow Friends! Purple stuck! Purple! I gotcha! Aw, Blue's well, going back to go save his friend Purple! Aw, that's so nice! Oh uh, no! Their entire home is burning down! Where's everyone else? No! Uh, what are they gonna do uh, now? What are we gonna do? That was our home! Those were our friends! This is so oh, sad! I don't think anyone could have made it out of there alive! It's all my fault. No! They couldn't save them! Purple, it's just you and me now. What? No! This might be the end of the Rainbow Friends. Not the end of the Rainbow Friends! Imagine if we lost our house in a fire! I would cry! Hey, freaks! Halloween's over! They think the Rainbow Friends are Halloween costumes! Uh, that looks like it hurts so bad! Use that! Uh, oh, I think I'm okay. It's just a bump. Look what you did to my cat! Nobody's asking Purple if he's okay. Why are you on it? This video is so sad, but it's not as sad as the secret video that we'll show you guys at the end. Ooh. Get a load of these guys. Poor Blue just wanted to go on the swing. Look at those costumes. Where'd you get them? The, uh, uh, the lame costume store? Oh, uh, he thinks Blue's wearing a costume too? I don't know. They look pretty expensive. You thinking what I'm thinking? No, no, they're gonna hurt Blue. No! No! Go to pay for that! No! Purple! Ah, the three against two isn't fair! Oh no! Come on, guys! I got a feeling this will be worth a pretty penny! Oh! No! Foxy, no. you're crying! Yeah. You're losing a heart! They're hurting Blue and stealing his crown, too! Now, uh, what seems to be the problem? They're getting away! Those kids beat us up and stole my crown! It was three of them. They went that way. Uh-oh. And, uh, what exactly are those costumes? They're not costumes. This is who we are. Right. <laughs> Stay in school, kids. He doesn't believe them? But he's a policeman! He's supposed to help! We better find somewhere to sleep for the night. What kind of hotel would take us in? Not like we even have the money. Aw, they have no money and it's cold! I don't cold. Know if I can trust you around fire anymore. It's too cold for jokes. Aww. Ooh, that's better. Rain! Where was that when we needed it earlier? Now it's gonna feel even colder! Somebody just threw out a box! They can use that for shelter! <sighs> what do we do now? I don't know. Get jobs or something? I can't work. I have no skills other than stalking and evisceration. <laughs> I could be a mover, maybe a trash man. I'm not sure. All I know is we're on our own now. Aw, they need to get jobs so they can make money. Day two without the Rainbow Friends Play Place. Things are harder than I ever imagined. <sighs> Brad never looks so good. Ooh, yummy! Aw, they're scaring the Rainbow Friends away. We don't have any money for food or a place to stay. So our only option is to try and find work. So they can rebuild their home. It's a tough world out there for two rainbow friends. Nobody would talk to us or even look at us. 
and if they did look at us, they ran off screaming. Oh, All man. All comfortable days of chasing humans through the play place and being subjected to Red's experiments are over. No! Sometimes you never realize how good you have it until it's all gone. Aww. At least I still have purple. Yeah! Well, I just realized I haven't eaten all day. Me neither. You know, worst case scenario... Blue's oh, got a lot of meat on him, right? <gasps> that could keep me going for a few days, that's for sure. What am I doing? Purple's my friend. Unless... He's thinking the same thing. Well, oh, no. They were both thinking about eating their friend! I have an idea. Hey, little fella. It's so cold and rainy out, but it's nice and warm in this box. Why don't you come on in and... Oh, oh no! Even the dog is mad! Yeah. Boy, am I glad it attacked you, because now I won't feel as bad eating it. <gasps> is that my little cupcake? The puppy has an owner? No, it's a dog. Cupcake! Come here, boy! Little Cupcake's been missing for days! Oh, you boys are just the best! You could have saved her life! Well... All in the day's work, ma'am. Here! Money! As a reward! Though my Cupcake is priceless! Did that really just happen? Whoa! Strange-looking fellows! A hundred dollars? That's way better than dog meat! No need to thank me. You? It was my idea! <laughs> I caught the dog and gave it to the old lady. You're the reason we're in this mess. No, they're fighting over the money. They must both be so hungry. Fine, we can share it. Just... Ah! Oh. What's going on? Orange? Orange? Orange, what's wrong with you? Hey, that's my trash. You can't have it. Why is Orange in the garbage? We thought you were dead. I thought you were dead. If you escaped, maybe Red and Green did too. We have to find them before something bad happens to them. Wow, that's so crazy that they ran into orange! I'm so glad he wasn't ooped by the fire. Look, it's green! Green, is that you? Guys, you're alive! Wow! You're alive! Oh, it's so good to see you. Where's Red? We're not sure yet, but we're looking for him next. When all of us band together, we can definitely rebuild the play place. I'm not going back there. I had my fun with the Rainbow Friends play place. But I think it's time to move on to bigger and better things. Wait, what? This job is great. People don't scream and run. They smile and laugh. And I get paid. What? Sorry, pal. We found a new one. Wait, what? They're replacing him? And we don't even have to pay this guy. So beat it. No, he lost his job. Fine. Let's find Red. Where do we even start looking? Where do smart people go? College. Where do smart people without money go? Uh, the library. Man, I really hope they find Red soon. Yeah. Oh, wait! I've been reading tips to fix up a house. With this knowledge, we can rebuild the play place in no time. Let go! But where did we get the materials? We lost everything in the fire. Wait, Blue, we have $100. Wait, what? Uh-oh, where'd they leave their money? Oh no, we left it in the alley! No! Green, you had a job. Did you get paid? I only worked for a day and a half, so not very much. How much? A couple hundred bucks. What? My money combined with the scraps of wood left over, as well as my mighty intellect and architectural talents, should be just enough. Boxy, they're gonna be able to rebuild their home! That's so awesome! Let's go! Aww. Everyone is working together! I'm so happy for them! Me too! And we still have lots of hearts left! So far, it's been kind of hard! I wonder what we're gonna see next! I can't wait! Let's go! Wait, is this SpongeBob alphabet lore? It's the alphabet lore, but they're all SpongeBob characters! This music is kind of making me sad already! Me too! I wonder what's going on! Hey, Ian looks just like SpongeBob! D do you guys see that? He also looks... Oops! I wonder what happened. Poor F has no friends. Guys, this might actually be the saddest alphabet lore video I have ever seen. Huh? Is that Doodle E? What's he doing to F? <laughs> Boxy, it looks like he's not oofed anymore. I think he wrote something on F that made him different. Why do they look so angry? I think he actually looks kind of cursed now. What's gonna happen? This is so crazy. Wow. 
Look, it's R just hanging out watching TV. Hey, is this Patrick R? <gasps> totally hacked into his TV! Oh, he looks so scary! How is he doing that? Do you think that maybe it's just a glitch? Mm. No! Oh. He crawled out of the TV? It sounds like he's doing the same thing that he did to F. Oh man, I hope he's okay! Oh. So now R is evil now too! Uh-oh. Wait, what? What? He could do that to money too? Uh-oh. Boxy! He's right there behind D! D's going to turn evil next! This is crazy! I don't want that! Whoa, it looks like he did that to all the Krabby Patties too! That does not look very yummy! Who wants an evil Krabby Patty? What's gonna happen if she eats it? This must be part of his plan to turn every letter evil! No! Probably like the time they forgot to put ketchup on my burger! Maybe they just don't know what's going to happen when they eat them! Oh. And their chairs, too! Oh, here comes P. Oh, no! P is about to walk into a Krusty Krab full of evil letters! Oh. No! The whole Krusty Krab was infected by those Krabby Patties that Doodley is scribbled on! Now everything has lost its color in there! Doodley is trying to steal the color out of everything! Let's ah. just jump it on P! No, poor P! She's gonna lose her color now, too! Boxy, you lost a heart! They're gonna take over the city now! Boxy, I'm afraid this is just gonna get even sadder! Me too! Just try not to cry! Uh-oh, a trash can just got knocked over! I wonder what's inside! <laughs> it's just cute! Ah, who is that? It's B sneaking up on B! And J! No, they're gonna scribble on and infect B! That's ridiculous! I'm so scared for C! See? Here they come for C! And you lives there too! They're gonna get both of them! Oh no! Here they come! And now they're gonna force everyone to turn evil! No, they tied them all up! And now they're gonna scribble on everybody who hasn't lost their colors yet! I don't know! There are way too many of them now! Wait, what's happening? Whoa! Oh, that's so mean! Is that Plankton? Oh my goodness! And they're infecting Karen! What letters do you think Karen is? Poor A has to just lay there and watch! No! No, he's crying! I'm gonna cry too! This is so sad to watch! Looks like the letters L and O, who aren't infected yet, are going to face M and K! Oh no! They turned to L and O! No! We both just lost the heart! Oh, M has been safe here this whole time! I bet he has no idea what's going on outside! M can see through the window that everything has changed! Oh no! Poor N! He's the only one left who hasn't been infected! I think N is really worried for his friends right now! This might actually be the saddest Alphabet Lore video I have ever seen! This is so not lit, bruh! Right, right, right! Oh, here they come! Then he wouldn't be buddies anymore! There's so many of them! N has to get away! But where is he gonna go? No! Oh, no! Please! We both lost the heart, Boxy! Oh no! N was distracted and didn't see that rock! Come on, N! Get up! Wait! Something's happening! H. N. It's H? Uh-oh! Wow! H must be magical or something! H. <gasps> oh no! They captured H in a jar! No! Don't cry, Foxy! Don't cry! But it's so sad! Wow, it looks like Ace brought N enough time for him to get to the castle. N, 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 N must be asking N, Z for N, help. N, N, N. Wait, what? Uh-oh. They were so strong that they broke down the castle doors. Wow! You have to somehow figure out a way to stop Doodly. Do you think King Neptune is powerful enough to stop this? <gasps> Whoa, magical scissors. Maybe these magical scissors could spawn Lucky Box merch! Yeah! <laughs> All awesome! Wow! She cut right through E! Those scissors must be so sharp! They cut through the pencil, too! Doodle E was using that pencil to infect everybody! And now they're all free! They're getting their colors back! Let's go! Wow! Aw, and N gets to have Q back! Yay! Whoa, check this out! Oh, I'm so happy that everyone gets to be friends again. You're my best friend, Foxy. Oh, Foxy, you're my best friend, too. <laughs> wow! 
Wait, mm. what are they gonna do with that eraser? I think they're erasing Doodle E so that he never does this again. Oh, look, there's Z just sleeping. Oh, no. Here comes P. <gasps> oh! What was that? Hmm, if I was P, I'd be kind of scared. Hmm. Oh, man. What's gonna happen to Z, though? This is crazy. Here comes F, and he does not look happy. Oh, man, I wonder what they're gonna do this time. Wait, is that G and C? Oh no! And P looks hurt! I think they found her like that! Whoever did it must have been hiding in those bushes! Yeah, I really don't know. Uh-oh, they do not look happy with F. Yeah, you're right. Do you think that it was F? Or do you think F is innocent? Uh, I don't know. Hmm, I think that they think it was F. Maybe because everyone's always picking on him! If someone hurt my friends, I'd be mad at them too! Yeah, you're right. This is insane! This is so sad! J-A-I-L? That spells jail! They're going to put F in jail! What if he's not the one who hurt P? He shouldn't be in jail then? What if somebody is trying to frame him? He looks so suspicious! This is the sad origin story of Bambolina! Bro, it's the end of chapter two! No! Oh, Bambolina's chasing! Hello, handsome. Uh, hello. Oh, I think wow, guys. Now, we're actually going to learn the origin story of Bambolina. I have a huge crush on Bambolina. I don't. No! Hello, handsome. Uh, hello. Oh, I think you might be snooping around places you shouldn't. Please, let me go. And why would I do that? If you do... I'll leave and never come back, I swear! Liar! I know your type! Well, uh, if you're not gonna let me go, what are your secrets? My secrets? <laughs> I'm not sure what you want to know. Oh, but since you asked... As a child... All I wanted was to be a star athlete. Bro, that's baby Bambolina. Got it. So we're going to learn how this girl got transformed into Bambolina in this video. Bro. I had the talent and drive to be one. I was a track star, a baseball star, and a volleyball star. Bro. So she was super athletic. She was good at every sport. She was a track star. You know what I mean? Hey, guys, that's lit. I mastered every sport I could to achieve my dreams. I was the pride of our school's athletic department. No one could beat me. And eventually, they stopped trying altogether. Growing up, I always felt like my dreams would come true. Unfortunately, one day, I learned the hard way that it rarely ever works out that way. Whoa, whoa! Oh, no! Ah! Uh, someone... <sighs> Help me! No one even knew I was out there. I was too hurt to get up, and I was sure no one would come looking for me. Until, out of nowhere, the school nurse found me. She saved my life! I was injured pretty bad. Of course, I needed more help than the school nurse could provide. But she carried me all the way to her office because I couldn't walk. Wow, that's really nice of the school nurse, guys. That's awesome. So she helped her. She was playing sports and she took a tumble or fell. She got injured, bro. Wow, she got carried just like you guys should carry some Lanky Box merch in Walmart and Target and get it. Let's go. She took care of me until the ambulance arrived. But it turned out that the injury was too bad for me to continue my sports journey. I had to give up everything I'd always dreamed of. I was heartbroken. Sports were my one and only passion in life. Though, in a way, I became inspired. The school nurse saved my life. And if I couldn't be a star athlete, I wanted to be just like her. So, I went to nursing school in hopes to do for others what she did for me. Wow, that's cool. So, guys, this is the sad origin story of Bambolina. That's Bambolina before she was Bambolina. So, she wanted to be an athlete, but then she got injured, and the school nurse took care of her, and now she wants to be a nurse. That's pretty cool. Nursing school in hopes to do for others what she did for me. And the perfect opportunity arose. A local kindergarten hiring for a school nurse? It's exactly what I was looking for. It almost felt too good to be true. <laughs> Silly me. If only I knew then what I know now. But not knowing any better, I went to the kindergarten for my interview. 
And that's where I met him. In that moment, everything changed for good. Hello, I'm Ban Ban, the founder and principal of this kindergarten. It was love at first sight. Oh, oh Brent! What are dude, you doing? that's crazy. What are you doing? Why'd you do that? Why'd I do what? Why'd you do that with your hair, dude? I'm not, I just, I, I don't know, man. I don't. I don't wish he was Ban Ban because then Bambolina would love him. <laughs> Stop, guys. Why'd you do that, bro? Stop. Whatever, 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 man. I just wanted to try she, new hairstyle. She loves Bam Bam. Adam, how does it make you feel, dude? I don't know. I don't know, guys. Let's find out what okay. happened. Principal of this kindergarten. It was love at first sight. Ugh. Everything about him was perfect. And I knew we were meant to be. Hi. I'm, uh, hi. I kind of bombed that interview. But I was the only applicant, so I got the job by default. And even if I got off to a rocky start, the parents and children took to me right away. While I appreciated all the love, it wasn't exactly who I wanted it to be from. Oh, my beloved Ban Ban. He still had my heart. Bruh, Adam, I know this is hard for you to watch, buddy. I know, I, I'm, I'm getting sad even just watching this here with you. Cause yeah. Adam has a huge crush on Bambolina. It's a little bit of a blow. This is Adam's diary. To my heart, guys, but it's okay. This is Adam's diary. I know I don't really have a chance. This is Adam's so it's diary. All right. Hey, wait a minute! Adam, Stop Adam, doing Adam, that! Adam drew himself holding hands with Bambolina. Listen, I, listen, Adam. All you gotta do is become like Bam Bam and then she'll love you. Right, right, exactly, right, guys. Right, right, right. I don't, right. Right. I was determined to have him. Somehow he ignored all of the signs. I bought us breakfast every morning. Here you go. I picked up extra just for you. Wow, you're the best friend a guy could get. <sighs> Bro, she got friends on my man, man. That's crazy. Adam got friends on by his own mommy. Now guys, my mom has been saying that I am down bad. Yeah. No, I've been saying that. You're down bad. I don't know what that means, but something feels... It means you're a oo-woo baby. It means you're a oo-woo baby. I don't, know, I don't know, guys. Your mom taught me You that. gotta just swing at every pitch yeah. and you never know what might happen. Yeah. Just for you. Wow, you're the best friend a guy could get. I wrote him inspirational notes. Look, I know why you're upset, but there's no way something like that could have happened at my school. There's no monsters here. What's this? Bro, says you're doing great. <laughs> wow. She wrote that for him, Adam. She must really care about him. Man. Yeah, it's it's tough to see this, but it is what it is, guys. Don't yeah. give up, Adam. I was close. I had a chance. You still got a chance. Yeah. And finally, I got more direct. Hey, Ban Ban, would you want to come for dinner tonight? Why, of course I would. Really? Yeah, my friend's in town. He can come along too. It will be all of us buddies hanging out. I thought I was being pretty clear in my intentions, but eventually I realized, despite all my efforts, it wasn't meant to be. I was heartbroken. My dreams of sports fame had been ruined long ago, and now my dreams of true love also seemed impossible to obtain. I felt lost, abandoned, was wrong, too tight? Can I tell you something? Of course. I saw something the other day, and it scared me. There was a strange door at the end of one of the hallways, he said. He'd never seen it before. A heavy metal door always stuck shut and locked. But one day, it was open. And being a young kid, he was curious. So, he walked in. Uh-oh. Nah! He told me he saw monsters. I told him it was just his imagination. But what came next? I don't know how he could have made it up. Ah! Run! I hoped he just imagined it, but I had a bad feeling. Because the next day, Marcus's parents pulled him from Ban Ban's kindergarten, and he wasn't the only one. 
One by one, Ban Ban's kindergarten became a shell of its former self as children kept leaving with no explanation. Dude, that's crazy. So that person went down the wrong hallway and they saw someone getting turned into Jumbo Josh. That would make me so scared. Bruh. Ban Ban, I know you're in there. I'm busy. Come back later. Ban Ban, there's something seriously wrong. We need to- I said I'm busy. He was no longer leaving his office. I had a feeling he was hiding something. I hated to betray my Ban Ban, but if he wasn't going to help investigate, I'd have to do it alone. So one night, I took matters into my own hands, and I broke in. Thankfully, coming in early and leaving with Ban Ban every day, I'd figured out the lock combination. And strangely enough, Ban Ban left his door unlocked, but I wasn't complaining. I took the master key. I had to find this door I'd heard about. <gasps> Oh, no. No. No, no. Well, there you go. No monsters after all. No. Oh, no. this thing is pretty creepy. Now, now, manners. <coughs> no! No need to be afraid. It's me, your Ban-Ban. You are not my Ban-Ban. What, what, what happened to you? Allow me to show you. What? I should have jumped on my ankle. What? I guess I have no choice. That's the Abby! Ah! No! Ban Ban, I don't know what happened to you, but you're still the same Ban Ban I knew. <laughs> what are you doing, bro? I'm watching the I'm video, man. I'm trying to watch man. the video. Why I turn back and you got your hair like that and you're doing this? I'm watching the video, man. Dude, stop. Let's keep watching. What's wrong with you, man? That's how you feel inside, right? I keep playing. All right. Whatever. All right. You're good at heart. You, you love people. You, you love children. It, you never let me get hurt. So pull me up and we can talk about this. <sighs> I knew you'd come around. Ban Ban, what are you... Let go of me. Hey. Let go of me! Bruh. It was too late for me. I know now what the kids had seen. And it was happening to me. I fought as hard as I could. Bruh. But Ban Ban was too strong. Ah! Ew! But if he did that to you against your will, why would you want that to happen to me? Let me just say a true thing right here. Let me say a true thing. Stop trying to be Ban Ban. <laughs> Stop it. I'm not. I'm not, dude. I'm not. <laughs> I'm not was, trying to be a huge custom man. Just because she likes Ban Ban. Let me say a true thing. Whatever. This right here. This right here. Uh huh. Adam wishes that was him. <laughs> he does that in his room, man. He makes. I, I'm about to say a true thing. I caught him in 4K. <laughs> he made a bambolina out of pillows. Dude. And he did that. He put himself up against the wall. No, I didn't. And he did the thing, man. I didn't. To himself, man. Stop! Adam did that. We caught him in 4K. We were that there. was in 4K? We, it. we were there. We recorded it. You said you were filming that in normal resolution, yeah, not 4K. Yeah, yeah, it was 4K. Oh, Foxy! Yeah, Adam was there with the pillow bambolina, bro, doing this, bro. Dude, whatever. That's crazy. Keep, keep That's watching. That's crazy. Keep watching. Adam admits he did that, dude. And he's trying to look like me. I'm not. I'm not. This is just how I have my hair nowadays. Like you said to him, you wanted to help people. You're good at heart. That was then. Now I've grown fond of this new body. And besides, it means I get to be alongside my Ban Ban forever. He did save my life after all. And what more could I want than that? Look, if I were you, I'd take a hit and get over him. Huh? Oh. Huh? Ah! Ouch! Run! Uh-oh. Yo! Whoa! 